hi everyone thank you for tuning in to this video actually this is my first video where i'm narrating and so let's get started shall we so i'll start off by laying out the materials materials i'll use um, i'm using crayola colored pencil and feel free to use any brand so real quick we're going to head to the to the, to the shading part We are going to start off with the pupil and we are going to use color black. outside um, I'm going to bring in some gray colors some yellow colors some peach and yeah and, and a little brown so just keep on shading shading putting some putting small strokes of of blue yeah. and also blend it with the white a pencil eraser to make some white to also make white strokes so the main reason why we, we are using markers and pen is to increase the contrast of the drawing realistic we're going to use light blue and blend it with white
focus on where the light is casting your object and bring up the concept of movement from light to shadows depending on where you want to start with. So in this case I'm going to start with the dark part. Um, feel free to start with the light part, depend with where you want to start to start from. So I'm going to start with the darkest part as I, as I go outside to to the light part. So I'm starting off with my dark color, then brown, then light brown, then pink. Um, so there's so many different kind of shading you can use. Um, you can do cross hatching. You can staple. You can just shade. So it depends with which style you're you're good at. So go back to the corner, to the middle part and try putting some white lines with your acrylic paint. Um, as I said earlier, you can use gel pen, you can use any kind. much for watching this video I don't know if I should make more videos like this in future you tell me in the comments below and if you like it give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more see you next time